Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world. Welcome to Sector 1FG. I am One Forsaken Gaming, and today we're going to be doing some content from the Sega 32X. Um, let me know if the sound is actually okay on this. Um, I have these games are, are it's either hit and miss in terms of some come in really loud, some of them come like really soft. So um, just let me know if I need to make any adjustments. Um, what's up, Big Baker? Welcome in there. Happy Saturday to you. Um, so I have several games we're going to be playing today, and including this one right here, Shadow Squadron. It's actually one of my favorite games to play um, for at least the first couple levels, and then it gets really, really ridiculous. <laughs> much, a lot, much a lot alone, a lot of these shmups games and everything. This is kind of like um, a Star Fox type of game type, uh, and all that goodness. Um, we're going to be doing some Dark Side, which is actually uh, after this one, which is basically... Um, like in a modern day ast like at the time of modern day asteroids game um but it's actually it's actually a lot of fun we'll see if we can actually complete a level or two on that one and i said this is mainly just a showcase today it's going to be just we're going to be going um could use a bump up yeah i thought so all right let's see here bump that up just a little bit i mean wait till i actually get into the game too because according looking at the game thing right now it looks like it's uh it's like super loud but as I said, some of these games come in super light, other ones come in like super loud, so like I said, just let me know if I need to make any adjustments for you guys. Alright, let's go ahead and have some fun here. Like I said, I'm just going to do like the first couple levels, just to kind of showcase, just to do a showcase for this. Uh, yeah, we're putting this on easy just because this is a... Uh... This was called Stellar Assault Overseas. Sounds good now, all right. All right, let's go. Right, let's just go, come on. I don't even remember what all the controls are for this thing, to be honest. <laughs> That's how horrible I am at these things. I haven't played this in a while, so I forget what I have to do. Just basically blow everything up. Ah! Shooting at me. Like weave and bob, weave and oh shoot. Get past these guys so I can come back around. Got that little dude. The no man's sky vibes. Oh, got him. Let me back up. Let me get ahead of these guys so I can oh. I wanted to say hello. Well there you go. <laughs> okay, let's turn around. I normally like to go for the little small fighters first to get rid of the minions, but maybe that's what... Oh, I caught him too. Nice. I'm not blowing anything up with these ships. What the heck? I don't want to crash into them. Oh, nice. That's twice now these guys have flown right in front of me. Aha! One ship down. Star Fox 3. Yeah, <laughs> kind of gives you that vibe, doesn't it? Where is that other ship at? Oh. Come here. Where'd he go?
I like how I can just press the I can just press the shoot the shoot button and hold it down and it's not uh Okay, that's that one. There was one other dude. There he is. He's hiding. Got him. Wee. Line in between the shots. <laughs> all right, I think this is all I got left. Mission there we got him. Sweet. All right. And so the funny that it overseas, this was, as I said, this was called Stellar Assault. This was not called Shadow Squadron. In the U.S., it's called Shadow Squadron. Just like um, the game I'll play next is Dark Side. It's actually, uh, I was actually only, re it's funny because there's a few, there's a few um, games for the 32X that were literally released only in certain parts of the world, which is really weird. <laughs> If you play the, the the Sega CD 32X games, there's six of them total, but one of them was only released in Brazil. I forget the name of that one. But yeah, it was, it was just... Uh... Okay, that's right. This one I have to blow up the gate and then the booster asteroid. Okay, got it. Okay, so I'm not aiming for the fighters this time. Oh, this is the target. Hang on. I almost collided with that ship. I had that one. Oh well. Thought I had it. I don't want to collide. Come on. That's the thing I have to go for, too. Just go back and forth between these two ships. Nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know where the target is. I just need to... I don't know how I avoided that one. <laughs> oh crap, I collided with it. Oh, what, what did I crash into? I was going in between it. Man, I just took some major damage. That was utter garbage. I know it's that thing. I need to get down there first. Now it's starting to shoot at me. <laughs> this thing's kind of a weird thing to fight. Ah! It's like you have to blow up certain things on here, or you have to basically go around it, and it just constantly keeps firing at you. The 
but don't stay in one place for too long. <laughs> Otherwise those bolts will freaking hit you. Starting to get some of it down. Eventually, eventually it'll go down, but it's just you have to find... You just have to blow up so much of it, and then it'll finally blow up. Like, there is a lock system on this, but again, this is the... I'm using a six-button controller, but all these games were designed to only have... The three buttons. There it is, we got it. Let's see if I can blow this thing up over here. There's fighters all over the place. get rid of this couple of these fighters just simply because this is the flat ship I need to blow up. They're all going to start attacking me. Ah! That's a fighter without their mothership. Got a few of those fighters. Get out of the way. Crap. Have to make another round. I have to try this one later absolutely man this is fun i just don't know what i crashed into earlier ah might want to take out a few of these fighters but i'm starting to get I'm low on health and i want to just blow this thing up because that's all i need to do <laughs> Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. There we go. Got it. Sweet. What's up, distinct bar? Looks looks dope. What is that? This is called Shadow Squadron. On the thirty two X. This is a carrying cartridge right here. Shadow Squadron. As I say, if it, over in Europe it was called Stellar Assault. What was the name of that 32X game? What? Baker, can you look up what the... Um, the six games for the for the the thirty two X Sega C D um I think it was something sight. I can't Surgical Strike I thought oh, Surgical Strike, never mind. I thought I figured it out. It was only released in Brazil. Of all of you know, anywhere in the world they could have released it all kinds of stuff, but Okay, so I only have one, two, three, four, five, six targets on this one. All right. It, it didn't show the ship. Didn't I shoot you enough? Ah, don't crash. 
We got rid of that guy, so now it's just me and the mothership. Oops. Helps if I go after this one first, right? Oops, I went right into the... Ah! Ah! It's like all of a sudden they upped the difficulty on this on this game. Dude, come on, ser dude, seriously? Dude, I'm I'm gonna die. Let's just blow up. <laughs> I'm just gonna restart. <laughs> This level is ridiculous. Like all of a sudden the, the, the things just get so much more difficult. And the thing is you can see from the only five games saw light of day with Scotty Pippen, Corpse Killer View. Yeah, I have all of those, but I do actually own all those, but they did make a sixth one called Surgical Strike, and it was only released in Brazil. Which is really weird. Dude, okay, so I'm I'm going the wrong direction when I'm trying Dude, seriously. All of a sudden, the difficulty has just gone like up like big time on this. It's taking me way too long to take this guy out. Yeah, Sergius was also really, oh, it was all yeah, it was, but it was it was the thirty two X is the one I want to try to get my hands on. And I can't blow this thing up. I do know it's just I think there was another one. One of those games was also released on the third on the uh, Sega CD, but it was uh. Okay, we got rid of that one. Now I need to head up here and get this one. Okay, if I want to go for those spiders or if I want to just blow up these ships. Watch out for asteroids. All good, sir. So we'll still be here. I so said we're going to move on to Dark Side of next, which as I said was only released in Europe. So I actually have a repo copy of the game. Because otherwise, I wouldn't be able to play it. <laughs> They flew right by me, so why not take them out, you know? Come on. Is it this thing?
It is this thing. All right. Now, now it says I passed it. Well, this is another thing I need to blow up. Whoa. I have to make a round trip for this one. Speed up past it and come back around. Whoopsie. Wait, that's that's what I need to go for. Where the heck did the thing go? See the other thing about this is like not only not only are you worrying about your health, which is the blue meter on the bottom right, you're also looking for there is. You're also trying to, um, the red meter is your fuel. Okay, I think I, I don't think I need to worry about that. This is, this is the big kahuna. I get rid of that fighter. Ah, you suck. Pick it out little by little. Eee. And that one ship, ship at the start of the level, man, that thing really massacred me. This one's for the, the, these ships are hard to dodge. Blew off part of the ship. Random fighter out there in the out there in the wilderness, so to speak. Yeah, let's get back around. He's still not dead. Still have another target? I have to blow this guy up or what? No, oh, I did. Nice. I made it. <laughs> yeah, this is what we'll do next here. As I said, this so this game here here is only released in uh, Europe. I was actually I actually did find a copy of it on eBay, but I was like, but someone actually snatched it up. I was kind of mad because <laughs> of that. Here I am trying. I was trying to save some money to get it and everything, and nope, somebody snatched it. Holy crap. Oh man, I gotta blow up all those ships. Holy crap. Yeah, I'm not making it past this. Maybe some of these ones might be not so bad. I also have this set on easy. Can you imagine if I had this thing set on hard? Come on, man, blow up already. 
Okay, I did get him. All right, let's go. Let's head on over here. Trying to shoot down that fighter that's in. That's right there, too. Oh, no, you don't. And even like the, the graphics and everything, when you blow stuff up and everything, it's actually kind of cool looking. Explosions and all that stuff. It's actually pretty cool. And I can't blow this sucker up. It's taking forever. Wait, hang on. Fighter moving to intercept. There we go. See, it also the the the, girl, the cool thing about this is that it also depends on like what you're actually aiming for, like what part of the ship you're aiming for, because that can make a huge difference on like what how much damage you're actually inflicting on it, and if you go, keep going for the same part of the ship. It'll blow up, it'll actually like the center of the actual ship versus just blowing up the, the like the outside of it and everything. It'll, it'll, it just all depends on what you're shooting at. Ah. I want to collide with it. Oh, hang on, there's a little fighter down here. No, it's not a fighter. Watch your radar, stupid. <laughs> And go. No way. I have to go for that one next, I think. Like, come on, man. I only got the bare bones of the ship left. Let's go. <laughs> Blow up already. <laughs> This is taking way too long. Come on, seriously? All right, we got that one. Okay, so that's that is the next one. All right, let's go. I said, if we blow up here, I'm probably going to move on to another game because this, this is the showcase show. I don't want to. Whoops! And I didn't. I didn't even stop. I'm. I'm still in like. I still have my afterburners on. <laughs> How dare you come after me? Now he's not going to move anywhere. Let me go out here. Go this way for a little bit and turn around. It was actually funny because I was we were talking about like uh, one of the games we were oh shoot one of the games we were talking about for the for the season for the um, for the retro league this season was. Um, Which one was it? Space Harrier? And uh, we, I was telling him that I said, well, the 32X technically is supposed to be the best version of it. Of like, if you're looking for a console version, Space Harrier on the gen on the 32X was supposed to be the best. And we're like, yeah, but we didn't want to have to have problems with emulation and on my tail I'm 
Ha, <laughs> he flew right in front of me. Nice. Ah. Oh, dodge, you dang dingus. Oh, jeez. How many more of these things am I going to have? I'm, I'm, I'm almost dead. Oh, nope, I blew up. Damn, that was that was tough. Yeah, see, we're gonna let it go though. Alright, we're gonna move on to dark side. Alright. Let's see here. Let me go ahead and turn this off. I'll get it back. Alright, so that was Shadow Squadron. Moving on to next one of these cardboard boxes when they. F ah. I don't have a box for this one, so that's okay. All that clankety clank. <laughs> Now let me know how the sound is for this because I don't know how loud or how soft the sound is going to be. So, a couple of games I said was as I started. I said the couple of these games are gonna are very loud. Other ones are very light. So I just want to make sure you guys can hear it okay. This uh, this one I think in particular it has really really light sounds so just let me know if i need to adjust anything so we're going to try to do a mission on this one it this this game is hard you know speed up speed down button and shoot that's it and no that's not like the frames that are actually you know that's the actual animation it's really quiet okay let me yeah, see, that's what I was afraid of. This game does come in extremely light. Let me, I... Still have some more stuff to blow up here, but we're gonna get rid of as many asteroids as I can. I don't know if that's any better. Let me know if the sound is any better, if I still need to turn it up more. See anything in my radar? Oh, in here. No, my microphone's on. Hang on. Maybe it's because I think the sound is on the game is just too loud. Let me let me turn this down a little bit. I know the game doesn't. Hopefully you can hear me. So this game is just, I like it, but it's, the, the sound is not very, very good. Yeah, no, all right. Yeah, I think it's because I had, it was too much on the, I think I had the volume on the game up too loud, so it was muffling me. It was it was uh, overpowering me.
Where's my radar at? Where are the asteroids? You know, just so you know how this game works is that if you look at the, on the side, the left side of the screen, that's my time limit. Oops. That's my time limit, essentially. I have until that ship reaches the moon. Uh, to do my tasks and everything, which is why this game is so hard, because they give you a lot of stuff to do. And destroying, or finding the asteroids and stuff like that is not always the easiest thing to do. I got two pieces left, then I can start going for some fighters. hell is it? it says it's right here dang it I don't need those I need the asteroids there it is there's one I got one piece left there it is Okay, now I can focus on the fighters. These guys. Ah! Oh no, you don't. Get him. Oh, there's another one. Where's he at? There he is. A lot of fighters. Hey, look at the size of that moon. <laughs> it's alright. I'll clash into him. At least he's gone. You know, I don't see that's the only thing though about this is like it's not it's not clear as to how many fighters you actually need to shoot down. I think you're really supposed to go for the ones that are like silver. Not these guys. Oh, I hope that's it. As I, and, and, and you don't know if you're successful until it tells you right here. See, I missed that one fighter at the end. That's why I said this game is ridiculous. It's it's like it's it you you're on a time limit, and if um, when Garrett plays this, if you play this on um, Uber, if he plays this on the on the Retro Pie, this game is moves even faster.
Dang it, no, 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 I don't want that little piece getting away. The problem is they burst and they, when they burst, they they completely burst apart. Makes it hard for you to find it. Where was that other one at? Speed up a little bit here. Slow down. Like, slow down. There's that one. Hey, come on, man, blow it up already. I think I got it. Got that one. Yeah, but it's like you're wasting it. Half your time is supposed to go towards, you know, getting these asteroids, and then other times it's supposed to be going for the enemies. But it's like, they, but sometimes this almost just doesn't feel like they give you enough time for this. There's that one. It's got one me medium size, and I got two small ones. There's that. There's the two small ones. I just need to find that one medium size, and we're good. It is. No, no, destroy the asteroid. Now we go for the enemies. Alright. Where are these little saucers at? This is Dark Side. field I don't need that that's that's what I'm looking for right here these buggers ah problem is is like yeah it's like you're looking at your radar and stuff and it's like I'm trying to see where they actually are that one
I want you. I want the silver ones. Oh, that was the last one. See, so you, you have to, that's the whole problem. See, you're searching for those, for the gray ones. You're not, sir, the silver ones. You're not searching for, you're not looking for the other ones. It sucks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Almost like, but see that, and the thing is, is they don't start showing up until about mid to like you're about like a quarter to a third of the way through the the time limit on the left side it sucks it's like they give you time to try to shoot down the asteroids but it's like my goodness this game is hard this game is a uh, uh, baker this game is on the 32x FYI. It's like trying to find everything is just, it's very inconsistent, but I don't know. It kind of gives you a rush of like an old school arcade game. What the hell is the next asteroid? Oh, there it is. speed up just a little bit so I can see what I'm shooting. That. See, like these guys here, it's like I don't really want to shoot them. I don't know if they're the ones I'm supposed to shoot at. I'm going to shoot this one. It all depends on the angle, too, because if you if you place yourself well, well enough, you can actually destroy all the asteroid within, like, one swoop. I don't want you. See, it's like these guys here, it's like, I don't want them. Yep, found it. Told you. But come on, dude. Where are these silver ones? These, those are the ones I want to destroy, and they're not even—they're not even showing up. That piece. I was gonna say there should be one more big old asteroid. Ah! Air brakes. There's two. Another one. Ha!
There's one piece of asteroid left. Ah. There he is. Let me get that asteroid while I see it. How'd I go? Oh, I don't want that. Like, where is it? The games aren't on here. Aren't on there, though. Yeah, well, it's okay. Oh, good. We got the asteroid. All right, cool. Now. Where are these ships at? There's those guys. Anybody else? I think I got rid of everything. Nope. Another one. Look at the size of that moon. I stand corrected. They are. It's in the Sega C. Yeah. Oh, that's right. That's right. That's right. They moved it over to there. That's right, they list them as that one. They list them as, see, there, see, I was successful that time. Sweet. Next mission. <laughs> Let's fail. Destroy all the asteroids, destroy the alien fighters. Rescue miners. Oh, geez. So now they're, now they're putting more tasks on you on your limited time. Fahrenheit, yeah, it's it's a firefighter game, basically. We got one miner. Where is he? There he is. Come here, little buddy. Got him. Got him. Got him. All right, cool. I said this this game is just fun because of what they're able to I mean it's tough but it's fun got rid of that little saucer let's, let's get it for another asteroid here Where are the miners at? Come on. 
Oops, I think I see one right there. All right, that's one. And this other thing is, is like they only give you so many shots with the with the uh, miners too because cool. ah, I crashed into it. Got him. Haha. Oops, got some miners over here. Oh, that's a star. Yeah, the saying over here doesn't help me. Like, where's the green dot at? Here he is. It's like, not only not, now I have to sit here and wait, 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 uh, spend time trying to rescue them, I also still have to eliminate all these asteroids. I think I've got the eight miners. I just need to destroy the asteroids now. Oh, I killed a miner. Oops. Wait, come on. Where is it? Let it out of your sight. I'm gonna fail this one too. Oh, I let him go. <laughs> It's so hard to interact with movies in the 90s, but failed miserably. Yeah, I remember like the Power Rangers one that you played. I probably failed this mission. I don't know how many miners I saved. Yep. I don't know what I missed, but whatever. I thought I saved over. I thought I saved at least eight, but that's all right. By the way, that's Dark Side on the 32X. Hope you guys enjoyed that little content. I'm going to move on to the next game. What do we got down here? How about we jump onto a fighter? Let's see. I know, it's like they didn't, they didn't, uh, they were just trying so hard. It just wasn't the same. The Power Rangers game on the Sega CD and stuff like that. It's like they just, they really, 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 really tried. Right, this one I'm probably going to have to turn down because 
going to probably come in very loud. Superman 32X, yeah, right. Alright. Let me know if the sound is okay. I don't know. I've never played any of these games before, but I've always went with this with the ninja. <laughs> Game audio is low. Okay, I turned it up a little bit. What are my buttons here? I have no idea what I'm doing. This was an excellent port. Yeah, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. It's all good. I'm going to turn it up just a little bit more. I pressed the kick button. He didn't even do anything. I mean, the original Virtual Fighter, yes, but... Oh, this is my block. Okay. They have a block button in this one. Got it. This is like Mortal Kombat. <laughs> Punch, kick, and block, yeah. Yeah, it's nice to know that I, you can do that stuff, but, you know. Okay, that doesn't do anything. <laughs> the jump is so wonky in this game, my goodness. Oh, come on, man. Where's my th where's my punch? I never tried Jackie. He looks kind of like Paul from Tekken. <laughs> like, wee! <laughs> Dude, man, this is only the second guy, and he's not even letting me make a move. Well, get up, stupid. <laughs> now, this is... I don't know how anybody can get used to this thing. This is not like Tekken. <laughs> Wow, that, look how much health that took away. My goodness, you see how much health that, that one move took away from me? Dude, it's like, I'm, what's the point of jumping if you're not going to do a throw a kick? This is terrible. 
I mean, it would help if I knew the moves and everything, too, but... Yeah, I have Primal Rage. Oh, come on. I mean, I'd rather be playing Soul Cow, Soul Blade than this thing. <laughs> Does, like, not everyone have a throw or something? Because I'm pressing the, the buttons together and it should be able to... Throw them, right? Yeah, this isn't... I'm not going to last long on this one. I can see why this didn't do well in the arcades. Not as many people played it. Yeah, it's like, I it, it, the getting up is like, it's so slow. It's like my point, my, my throws are, my everything is just... Like even even your quick attacks are ter even your just like your quick punch your regular punches are horrible in this. They're super slow. Plus I think I'm hitting the wrong button too, but whatever. It's like, this is the third character, man. Gee, I actually won a round. What do you know? Jump is so bad in this. It's like, why would you even jump in this game? I mean, seriously. Woohoo! Uh oh. <laughs> I thought there was a blank screen. I thought it froze on me. I was like, oh crap! <laughs> Dude, come on, man. Quit being chicken. Oh, he can. I get. I go for a combo, and he doesn't. And he just stops in the. He just stops me in the middle of mine. Oh, this is this is terrible. I think I'm gonna beat him, and I'm just done with this. And I said it was the only reason why I got this. The only reason why I haven't played this is be or why I got this is because it's for the collection.
I mean, he just, he was he just landed from an attack for goodness sakes. Yeah, he turned around perfectly fine. What the hell, man? This is ridiculous. How did any how did anybody play this thing? Yeah, this guy plays like Paul. He's more my style. I like it. <laughs> yeah, well, okay, whatever. I mean, I don't mind it so much. It's just... Dude, all he's doing is just keeps jumping backwards because the time's running out. It's like, that thing is just stupid. We should have knocked out a dive in on his head. Yeah. <laughs> like, at least a broken neck. Yeah, something like that. Like, dude, I can't even get a move in on this guy. Where's my block? I was holding block. I mean, this is this is just stupid. I mean, I, I yeah, I'm done with this. I'm sorry, no more. <laughs> yeah, it's like I, seriously, it's. I mean, it was just designed. I mean, how, I don't know how. I just uh, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, enough of that one. I mean, if I knew what I was doing, maybe perhaps. But I mean, that was only like the third, fourth character, and it's like. Acting like it's the final boss. It's like, that's just ridiculous. This one will be interesting. I haven't actually really played this much, but it's kind of interesting. It's not quite the same, but as you would expect, but it's not exactly the... Uh... Got here. You know if they need to adjust any game audio. This game probably comes in a little bit loud. Audio's fine. Okay. I'm going to turn it back up. Let's see how well this is. played this the other night. Well, I don't know how this thing works, so... Whatever. I think 
Can I? Okay, I should have just skipped it. Get over here, dummy. Yeah. <laughs> I have to do that. Okay, hang on. Hang on, I got this. I have to face the other way. Hang on a sec. Oh, wait, I opened it. Okay, never mind. Let's go. Kind of weird. It's like it wants to... I've never, I've never really played this, so Wait, that's not gonna work. Wrong way. It's kind of like weird controls, but not really. It still feels like it's a... I didn't play it very long, lost patience. Yeah, it's, it's not your typical... It's not... It feels like a Sonic game, but at the same time it doesn't. I don't like this ring thing that you have to do. Although I do like some of the I do like SBO as a character and stuff, but I just I not I think what they could have included some of these other ones, you know what I mean? Aw. I missed something. Can I climb walls? I mean, it's not, it's just not the same. Oh my gosh, how long is this? This is only the first level, my goodness, what the hell? <laughs> Hey, Captain, what's up? Good morning. I do have actually, now it's a, you made me remind, you reminded me there, Captain, this is actually a, 
Uh, one of the things that um, I did want to um, let everybody know that the uh, the new logo for next year is is uh, has been completed, and I'm actually going to be showing it off. Okay, that's not the way I have to go. We're going to be showing that we're going to make its debut tomorrow at the end of the stream. And we got Sith is in the house. Good morning. I have no idea where the hell I'm going. Alright, if I see rings, that's a good thing. Oops, I did not mean to summon him down here. And so how the hell do I get up there then? A shower before I start up myself. There we go. This is all four. Oh, I missed it. This is weird. That's kind of stupid. I have no idea what this is. And we got a gift sub to Mr. Captain. All right, I have no idea what this is. I missed a rage quick. Yeah, no, I did. It, it, it's terrible. I'm gonna just do a couple levels for this and see what it's like. Just so I can. This is just a. I said this is a showcase show. I want to see what these are. I said this was a speedway. All I'm doing is running. <laughs> got the other guy now We're not and we don't have SBO anymore whoopsie let me up Second here, we got the Metroid hat and we got the Knight's hat. Uh oh, uh oh, we're fighting here. 
<laughs> what is this There's sparkling leather that's going on? Oh, this is this is Knuckles Chaotix on the 32X. It's quite different than what you're usually playing for, like the Sega Genesis and the typical Sonic games. This game is not what you think it is. This is a Knuckles game, yes. Hang on, alright, but we got the Redemptions. I'm gonna put on the... Wait, which one was first? Okay, I'm gonna do the the Metroid hat for now, and then once I'm done with this game, we'll switch over to the Knight's hat. There we go. How's that? How do I look? Right in the middle. All right. But yeah, this is this is Knuckles Chaotix on the 32X. So we're debuting some some 32X games. We're showcasing, I should say. Why can't I go through there? There we go. I just didn't have him with me. Let's try again. Never heard of the Sega 32X? It's it's a monster. I'll just put it that way. But it's basically it's an attachment to the Genesis, which allows you to um, play better games. But it also allows you to play the... Um, It also allows you to play Gen your Genesis games. Is it's also backwards compatible. It's an add-on. It's an attachment to the Genesis. They give you like little, um, you all. But the thing is, you also have to have the Sega CD for it to run. It's really, really, really stupid. But whatever. Missed it. Oh come on! Can't slow down either, which is what sucks. Just barely made that one. Yeah, it's an add-on to the Genesis. It's basically you get some clips that you that you attach to the Apparently I got a chaos ring. Yay. <laughs> so basically, but the thing is about the about it is so basically how it works is the concept was amazing just didn't take off yeah 30 seconds are cartridges they're cartridges and discs depending upon which the well it's they're they're both you get you get both of them with this console because i said you have to have the sega cd and the 32x in order for it to play yeah it's like let me i'll show you because um, there are there are 32x Sega CD games. But as you can see, it's a it's it's a disc game. It's a Sega CD game, but it's meant for the 32x. So they give you both versions of it. I don't know if you can actually see that. I'm not trying to let it break apart, but that's the the 32x version. But you have to have. You can play either version, but if you want the upgraded graphics and stuff like that, you can play it on the 32X CD. It gives you both. But most of most of the there were there were actually only 32 
I'm sorry, 32. There were only there were only 40 games actually released for this console before they decided to call it quits because it just they just wasn't selling. There it was to the point where, dang it, come on. They they were selling the the 32x for like 32 or like 20 bucks because they just wanted to get rid of them. Because the the biggest problem that the, that it had with Sega was that they were they were already working on the Saturn. They were already working on the Saturn. No idea what any of this. Oh, it's a bonus stage. Okay. I see the exits. Yeah, I can't see everything though. Oh, I hit the exit. Oh well. Not work well when they they should. Yeah, that too. But yeah, they were they were working on the Saturn already when they developed this when they made this concept for the for the Genesis, and it just. You know, it's 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 a cool concept nonetheless, but and I really wish they could have done more with it, but it just didn't sell because and one of the main problems though too with it is that is that um you have to have a power supply for the Genesis, one for the Sega CD and one for the 32X. So you have to have three power supplies hooked into this. It's crazy. This is crazy. What the hell? Dude, how can anybody... I mean, I understand the concept for this, but my goodness, this is crazy to try to figure out. We missed this one. Oh, so it keeps going? Even though I didn't get them all? Well, that's interesting. Oh. Okay, so at least it doesn't give you, like, ends the special stage when you until you actually get it. That's kind of cool. I can't, I can't even see where... Yeah, this that, that's bad design. This game seems like a hardware shore off. Yeah, it definitely it is. If they had skipped the 32x... Yeah, I would, I would totally agree with that. Oops, I missed a spear. Dude, seriously? Come on, let's go. Oh, so you have to get rings. Oh, okay, so you have to get rings in order to stay in the actual thing. Got it. Okay, I wasn't even paying attention to that. I already was there. All right, we'll finish this one off. We have the. Oh, so cool. All right, we're good.
Oops, wrong way. Oh, he had a gray. He had a gray ring. It's more about the using the ring to actually like propel yourself and stuff to go faster. Versus actually um, using your spin dash and everything, it's just which is kind of interesting, but I don't know if I really care for that. Apparently, I made Espio freaking huge. The jump in this is kind of wonky too. This looks like something that, no. I had to get us both in there. Hitting motion sickness, yeah. I won't be playing, I'm gonna finish this level, I think, and that's gonna be it. I'll play this on another time. There's just too much, I mean, I don't even know if I'm going the right way. Uh, that's Espio. There's three different characters, and I don't know all their names, but I know this one because I thought he looked the coolest. <laughs> I think I need to be up on top. Bugger. I'm the B character. I want to get up there. No, I didn't want to do that. Get up top. Frustrate you no end. Yeah, it's kind of just... I, I'm trying to figure out what the heck I need to do. This game isn't the easiest to figure out. I just want to keep going up, it looks like. Really? Oops. It's like, I know you can actually bounce yourself up and everything too, but... How the heck do I get up here? It won't latch on. It's like, I don't know if I'm supposed to go down, if I'm supposed to go this way, but it didn't look like there was... There was something blocking my path. Okay. Now I'm actually getting somewhere.
There we go. Now I think I'm actually getting somewhere. Like, I don't know, this game is just confusing. I can remember when GamePro relate re um when they reviewed this game, they didn't review it very well. I said it looks like they were just trying to do something with the Sonic franchise with on the 32X and this is what we got. Okay. Oh, what are you doing? I think I know what I need to do. Like, I think I know what they were trying to do with it, but... Okay, so I can't go that way. Then where the hell am I supposed to- oh, I can go up this way? No. Well then where the hell do I need to go? Well there's an enemy right there, so... Oh, there it is. You're a vigilant, my friend. You would have put the controller down so long ago. Well, I mean, it just... I... It's a Sonic game, so it can't be all that bad. Or that hard. Right? <laughs> Sorry, I missed something earlier. What happened here? Yeah, I didn't get to, I didn't get the sub screen going here, so let me go ahead and get that going. I'm gonna go ahead and stop here with Knuckles Chaotix. We're gonna move on to another one. Think about Mario games. <laughs> Thank you again though for the gift sub. Let's go. Thank you again so much for that. All right, we're going to stop here with Knuckles Chaotix. Where I said, this is a showcase show. We're, not, we're just showing off different games for the 32X. If I actually want, once I figure out and have some time to actually play some of these games, to figure out what I need to do and everything. Then I'll, then I'll go back and do them, but. I think Mr. Baker is going to like this one. We'll switch over to the knight's hat. And Suddy, good. Hey there, one F. Suddy, how you doing? You know, we got the knight's hat on. <laughs> this thing is so big. I have to make sure the controls are all like God, man, I, I need to I need to like lower myself if I put the knight's hat on my goodness there we go <laughs> thing is so it's so nice it fits like perfectly too first time chat twitch we added 50 oh yeah that's right there's a 10% um, bonus for every single um all the biddies and stuff like that so but thank you so much study let's get some squishy going let's go got a gift sub too my goodness man we are getting all kinds of good stuff this morning and a, and a gift and a resub let's go all right thank you so much Sadi, for all that you're much appreciated my friend 
All right. Yeah, if every all the all the biddies that we get for the month of December, Twitch is giving us an extra um 10%. I think it is something like that. All right. And we have another gift sub. My goodness, man, you guys are killing it today. Wow. Thank you so much. We got one more sub screen coming. Which one should we do? Let's get some Mario action. Let's go. I don't even get to play my game. <laughs> Enjoy those emotes there, Sith. All right, now let's see if we can actually do this now. All right. Uh, six button controller. Let's have a look here. Okay, so high quick, high fierce. Okay, so these are my buttons here. One, two, three, four. All right, let's see if I can. Uh... All right. So the the last two are extra. So my four. Okay, so it's four buttons. Got it. Hang on a second here. Get my. Con okay, he's not throwing the fireball. Why? It's both buttons? It was never like that before. Right, this is the... I'm just getting used to my buttons here. Sorry, guys. I'm sorry. This is not going to be a very good couple rounds. But we'll get through. You'll get used to it. Love the hat. You like my... my uh... There's a scene for this game. Yes, there was actually, but it was very short lived. This game was like, you had to. This game was, uh, was very short lived when it came to. Oh, how did he get behind me? This is so different from the arcade version. I don't remember it being like this. Dino knows Pepper Breath, the Digimon reference. <laughs> yeah, Sauron was always like the freaking horror, most, like the, the worst freaking. This game was made by actual clay models. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they did. That I do remember. Okay, I think my, my buttons are in reverse. doing enough damage here <laughs> I can still feel the floor shaking playing this arcade game here yeah. it was loud
Bring you. Like my moves, are, like the moves are just no. This is this is not the same. Oh yeah, whatever. Oh come on, man! We should have the same. We have like the same amount of power. That's the thing we have to the to this barcade. I mean, it's not bad for a 32x, I'll give it that, but... Oh yeah, you're just getting desperate now, aren't you? I probably didn't do it. Nope, I did do it. Yay! <laughs> I do remember it. <laughs> Game I always look look for is Marvel vs. Capcom 2. Yeah, no, it's a it's a good that's always a good classic. Play on was massive. Yeah, it had the it has the um Oh come on, where's my block? So I don't like the fact in this game you had to hold your, you had to hold the buttons down in order to throw moves. Aha! We got him. <laughs> oh, the monkey freeze probably would have been my main in the game, though. Yeah, probably. The brain underneath is like your stun meter. Your boy. You love the hat. You love my little Knights into Dreams hat. This is your go-to yeah uh, it, if you can if i could knew <coughs> excuse me if i could get his combos to work the way that they should and learned them actually learned them i'd say definitely but this, this i don't like this thing plays a little bit different than the arcade that i'm used to playing on and which is why i'm not doing so well because a lot of my moves are not they're not doing what they're supposed to do I'm gonna go lurking breakfast time. All right, it's all good. Rage. Whatever. Dude, come on, man. I'm already kicking you in the face. Time to hydrate. All right, I got some. I uh, I just have basic water today, guys. I didn't 
I just, I, it, I've had one in here last night and I just couldn't, I didn't uh, change it out. <laughs> and spend at channel points, I have quite a few. Yeah, it's all good. Rage. I forgot to turn the WinFG tune on, but I played it yesterday during my, um, I'll just roast him again. Yeah, another one, huh? <laughs> Cheers, Seti. Don't no support me, one of G. I appreciate it, Seti, man. You're kicking butt today. Let me um let me go ahead and pause this. Get our next sub screen going here. So I got one more game I'm going to show off, I think, today. Whoopsie, what do we have here? There's Star Fox. Let's go. All right, there we go. Thank you again so much. Arg. They're just beating me to everything, why don't you? He's just not even letting me make a move. My goodness. I never seen him I never see him like this. I almost got this for a third for a Sega Saturn too, but they said that this port was actually better. <laughs> well, hey, if whatever the shoe fits, man. Hey, if you're having that much of a problem here, I'll just gonna keep blasting you with fireballs. Let's see how you like it. <laughs> What's up, Angel? Good morning. Boom. Whoops. Now he just wants to kick my butt. Nope, I got him first. Three months described. Mrs. MJ's in the house. Rage. Yeah, get out of my face. And Mrs. M, man, and M Jar is also here. Welcome in, you guys. Thank you so much for coming in. So we're gonna have to do one more game after this, maybe two, depending upon how well that other one goes. This is my Sega 32X showcase today. I think it's, yeah, okay, it's counterclockwise, that's what it is. I was just, I, it's like three buttons, and then he has, he has like, he has like three or, he has like two or three different fatalities, but I can't remember what the other ones are. Ouch. Ow. Big 
Dang it. Like trying to get the trying to get the actual like special moves to link with the combos are like almost impossible to do with this. If I were to play this off of my um my midway treasures on the um on the GameCube, I would I would definitely be able to do it to do these combos a lot better. <laughs> the computer doesn't seem to bode very well against my super fast fireballs. Nice. <laughs> Ah, oh, he got it. He got one through. Oh, come on, really? It sucks. You can't skip all that. <laughs> And just a reminder, folks, if I dinosaurs can't jump. Well, apparently in this one they can. It's like he has a he has a Diablo has a headbutt move, but I don't know why it's not activating. It's supposed to be a half motion with like a one of the kick buttons. And he also has a stomp too, but Oh, come on, that wasn't even fair. It's like, and I was holding block, too, so I should he shouldn't have been able to do that. Whatever. I only know how to use Diablo, so I do apologize if you're looking for another dinosaur. Ah. I should finish him off. There we go. <laughs> enjoy the moon. Enjoy those emotes. Rage. Actually, the one thing I really, I really was hoping for eventually down the line was um, that um, Midway would go back and re and and actually release Primal Rage 2. It was only a, it was only I was able to play a a um what is it? I was able to play a um a demo of it, well sort of sort of a demo, but a prototype, I guess you should say. And actually it was a really good game. It was a lot of fun. They had it at California Extreme this year and it actually uh the prototype they actually had it there and it actually and willie will who was who went with me he would actually be he actually uh we we both enjoyed it a lot and wish and wish they actually would have released it it was so much fun If you yeah, if you can sometime look it up on YouTube. Just type in Primal Rage Two and look it up. It actually is a lot of fun. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, don't even try to outdo Talon, man. He's gonna rip you a new to rip you apart. Not you, not you, Talon, but. The dinosaur on the screen. Got 
everybody's here. We got all, almost a lot of people in, in here today. Oh, come on. I'll just let the time run out then. I'll take the easy win. Take the easy win. Ah, that was quick. That's not what I did. See, it's like I'm holding the... I have to hold the buttons down to do these special moves, and it's just ridiculous. All right, let's go. Not what I'm doing. Talon, yeah, that that's a that's a Metroid. I'm not trying to Talon's my my opponent. <laughs> that's not what I did. Roast him. The, thing, the only thing is about for me is like I have I have more 32x games, but I like I don't want to. But they are uh, brand new. They're still sealed in their in the packaging and stuff. So it's like I don't really want to break them out to play them. Rage. But like I have one called Cosmic Carnage, which is also a fighting game. Um, this is how you beat Diablo or um, Vertigo. Um, I have the virtual, I have a racing game. I have the yeah, Cosmic Carnage, and I have one other game that's that's still sealed. It's like I don't want to. I don't want to break them out because they're so they're brand new. All about timing. Oh, come on. Coffee break. <laughs> yeah, Cosmic Carnage isn't that, it wasn't that much. But this one was a brand new copy. That's all right, we'll take the win. I mean, because other than that, I mean, the only one that I think I might I might do today is I might go back and do some. Um, I might do some. I don't know. Rage. I can't see because the it's literally right where my light is. I mean, I didn't spend that much for Cosmic Carnage because it wasn't that well received game, so. See, he has the, see how I mean, he has the shoulder tackle. I don't understand why he's getting knocked over by one stupid attack. Uh, 
don't know how that's hitting me, but whatever. Yeah, whatever. Ugh. I'm just looking at all the games I have over there. Come on. That's what I did. I feel the world is fine now. See, that's what I'm doing, but he's not doing it. Oh, he clipped me. He gave me that little bite, and that's all it took. <laughs> We're actually getting somewhere, dang it. Let's say Mortal Kombat 2, Calibri, which was that hummingbird game, like a shooter type of thing. Oh, come on, I'm holding block, not jumping. Yeah, of course. He has that just that sliver of core. Yeah, whatever. Slow fireball, double shoots. Hold two and four. Yeah, no, I it, it's the I I have it down. It's just the the. It's just not the it, it's not what I'm used to. Because when I play the uh, the arcade version of this, it's entirely different. The controls of the controls in this are a little bit wonky. Which is why I'm not doing that well. Which is why I'm not getting any combos, which is why I'm not getting anything going. And yeah, just let him beat me. Because I said I play this on if I were to play this on the on the arcade version, uh which is the um No, oh, I guess I ran out of continues. Oh well. All right. Well, anyway, that was Primal Rage on the 32X. We're gonna play one more game here as we showcase the 32X today. I'm not sure again. I don't know what I feel like playing. We did quite a few games actually. Started off with Shadow Squadron. We did uh, Dark Side, which was a lot of fun. Oh, this box is a little bit mangled. We did Knuckles Chaotix. A uh, little bit of Virtua Fighter before I rage quit. <laughs> uh, let's see. All right. Actually, you know what? I'm going to do Calibri just because. Hang on a sec. Hang on a sec, guys. I have showcased Calibri before, but. I just love the way this thing looks. It's just beautiful looking. I don't remember what my controls are for this. Let me know if the sound is okay, if I need to make any adjustments. Do I have Blackthorn? No, but it is on my list. Uh, 
That's the speed button. Don't get eaten by the frog. Alright, let's get this game started. It's so cute. And this game is just beautiful too. This gun. Ah! Give me back my ring. That one's done. Let me see if I can find a better weapon. Red one's the one I really like. Actually, that one's not bad. Let me try this one. Let me get this one all filled up. There we go. Killed all the bad guys. Yeah, it, it is. It's really beautiful. Ow. Oops, I have to go back and get my... I've got to kill all those guys. Hang on. Got to return all the stuff back to the... Darn hornets. Go away. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to breakfast. All right, so big baker, thank you so much. Ah, I wasn't watching where I was going. Thank you so much for being here today. We'll see you next time. We'll see you tomorrow. Actually, I'll probably hit you up later. Those birds have got it all. Oh, there we go. This is what I wanted. That's all those. Should be one last one down here. Ah! Oops, I'm done. Careful for the frog. We don't want to get eaten by the frog. There we go. So I'll do a few levels of this because... I'm not going to need that. Ah. Uh. 
Why am I not hitting them? Oh, because I have to destroy all the other bugs first. Okay. There we go. You have to make them angry. See? Ow! Here, Froggy, why don't you eat this ladybug, this monster ladybug? Let's see if there's another weapon. I hate this thing. It doesn't do enough damage. I think there's like 20 stages in this game or something like that. We're only going to go through about 6 or 7. It's kind of like a free roaming type of thing that you can kind of just, for the most part. Try to catch me. Uh huh. I mean, look at the, the only thing I don't I have a problem with is the the water in the background isn't moving. That's not the weapon I wanted. Ah! <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. All of a sudden, there's this big old ladybug in front of me. No, not this weapon. Crap. Watch out for frogs. Go. Ah, I got the big one. Ow. Oh, I almost flew right into that frog. Health would be nice. That's a great thing about this weapon. Is like it, it's 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 great when it's in front of you. But it sucks when it's when it, when enemies are behind you.
There we go. I forgot I had the special. Stupid hornet snuck up behind me. <laughs> oh, I'm down to my last health. Oh, that's just fabulous. Yeah, I, I got too greedy there. I think this is the furthest I've actually made it in the game. Because this, this, it's, this level is like an endurance level type of thing. And I'm starting the level, and it saved me with just one health, so... isn't really keen for me. Come on, I already took a hit. Come on. Oh! Man, this sucks not having any health. And the hummingbird's not exactly the easiest thing to control either. not to get this thing. Oh, that's the one I want. <laughs> I'll get you the hydration in just a moment here. I mean, I can actually make it through this thing. Pause this real quick. All right. Not that one. This one. Yeah, there we go. Health, please. I understand I have another. Do you like it? Yeah, this is a fun game. If you're not careful right there, that iguana will eat you. You know, if you want to try to get that ring. Gosh, took a hit. No! 
Oh, man. Man, there is no health in this level. I had to start it all over again. And I had the best weapon, too. It's a hunter, but it's like, it's a hunter weapon, but it's like, it's whatever's in front of you. Like each weapon has a um a third level to it. Hey Uber. Shoot, I just took a hit. Arg! I need health. Sidey with another gift sub sub. Wow. He's on fire today. I'll get you that sub here once I die again, because I know I'm, I have no health. The bird can take, a, depending upon your level, it can take up to four hits. The ring gets to go to a fifth hit. Arg. Excuse me. Plus, it's like, I don't want to grab any of these other weapons because I already have the max. Oh, shoot. No, 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 no. No, definitely don't get that one. Go. Get you that gift sub screen here in just a moment. Coming up to the end of this one. Okay, go on is there. Just make sure we don't get eaten. It's not letting me move. What the hell? Come on, man. That wasn't even fair. You're a Sega fan boy now? Yeah, absolutely. I said, especially for me, it was the, the, the 32X is definitely um, something to check out. I know you have been already. <laughs> but we got another gift sub. We got another sub screen. Let's go. Thank you again so much, Suddy. Let's go real quick here. Cool. I'm just gonna give this another couple attempts, and then um, and then we're gonna wrap up for the day. I, I don't. As I said I don't think I'm gonna finish this level, so I just don't have the health. Crap. Ah. Well, good. I I didn't get I didn't get the weapon. I I switched weapons by accident. <laughs> yes i said now this now you understand why this is the this is the level i've made it to i finished the last level by accident with no health which is causing major problems for me in this one nope i ran right into that bug And I can't, and it, the sad thing is, is when you, it saves it, it does like a, a save where you're at, you know, type of thing. So, and it keeps all your health. So when you enter, when you enter the password, it's almost best if like, if you go back and you just enter the password, because then you can actually start the whole level over again. That 
one then. It's like the best weapon. Don't get eaten by the frog. Yeah, if you get the, if you if you jump if you if you fly right in front of the frogs or the iguana's mouth, dude, they eat you. They they stick out their tongue and they eat you. It's instant death. Crap. You have to be extremely careful. Hey, outcast, welcome. Good to see you, brother. Thank you so much for coming in. Hope you up everything's going okay for you. We're just playing some 32x here. Or this game is called Calibri. You're, you're a hummingbird. See this? That, that's not fair right there. I can't move my bird. Look at all those hornets. I was trying to turn around, gosh darn it. Oh, there was the end! <laughs> Crap. Best it can. <laughs> I wish I could say the same for this bird. I said I love the way this game it looks. It's beautiful. I said for a 32-bit cartridge, man, this is an amazing look for what they did back in the day. I'm so, I'm sad that you know they couldn't make a this would be another game I would love to see more. Um, but you know, the 32x didn't do very well. Oh shoot! No, 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 no! Give me that. Where is it? There it is. How many different weapons? Oh shoot! I just took my hit. Let's see here. You have surgery on Monday. Everything all right? Well, you can always... Hey, what's up? Mad Chill is also here. I welcome in, you guys. So close. As I said, I'm going to give this like one or two more tries. I, I, I just... The problem is that this level just doesn't give you any health. It's just, a, it's just an endurance round. I almost made it, but... I said my biggest problem is that one part you can't control the bird. It just... Oh shoot, whoops. <laughs> I almost got eaten. <laughs> oh come on, that hornet didn't touch that one did. App. It's like you can't get mad at a game when it's a bird that you're that you're using to do your to do your dirty work. <laughs> Where's that third level? There it is. Wee! Didn't get the nectar out, yeah. <laughs> ah! Oh, crap. Got me. No, you don't. The problem is with the bird is like you don't. It, if you press up, it takes like a second for you to because you're. It actually is very realistic in terms of like the flight and everything. Because it's like you can't just when you press up, you don't go up right away. And when you go down, you don't go down right away. 
it's like it, it's like a little it's like it's like a little floaty so to speak so the controls are a little bit take a little bit getting used to but it it, it feels like you're actually flying shoot i lost my ring already yep dang it I think it's gonna be my like, my last try here. I'm just I'm just I just don't have the health. If I would have had one or two more hits, I would have I would have definitely finished this level already. Yeah, the floaty controls. Yeah, no, that's that's just how it is. I'm okay with it though. Luckily they don't shoot at you. I mean some of these level the, the great thing about this game is sometimes it's a it's a um it it's like a uh a puzzle type of game and then other times it's just like a shooter like a shmup type of thing there's one page that likes to do that he, he likes to do shmups and I, I, I was actually gonna suggest this one to him but I don't know if it would I don't know if it'd be his kind of thing but this is is this our type of the bird yes ex yeah, yes exactly R-type with a bird. You have that exactly correct, sir. Too much shit flying at me. See, I can't... The bird right there, I, I can't control him. That's just stupid. And so I don't have the ring right there. These graphics... I know, aren't they fantastic? For, the, for a 32-bit system, I mean, this was... Oh, shoot, this is not what I wanted. I don't want that one either, though. See, this is a great weapon, but it's it leaves you vulnerable for the, to the other side. Oops. This is phenomenal, yeah. This is a pretty setting as well. Yeah, no, I, I said this is it's great. The, the what they were able to create with this game. I said, I said this is kind of one of those. Whoops, reminds me of Bob Ross paintings. Kind of, doesn't it? <laughs> That's you know, some that was exactly what I was trying to think of. Was the uh, was Bob Ross? Kind of, kind of gives you those vibes. I already took a hit. Stupid hornets. Hornets have overthrown the land, and you must save them. Or you must save your fellow birds. No, I didn't want this. I was pressing back, darn it. Ah, lucky shot. I said that was going to be my last try, then I just like, I keep going. Oh, there's some health. 
Yay.